slide is a bit louder. Uh, okay. Uh, thanks for coming to my talk. Okay. My topic is that uh, local weather information and Geelong cell uh, extension. Okay, so my name is Samsung. Um, um, I'm a software developer. I use and develop open source software. Uh, in the open source uh, world, I starting from writing out open and then change to uh, PHP and then switch to uh, Python. And I inserted and uh, at the uh, data mining and also the web scraping technology. And I'm a consultant in uh, web technology. And I'm also, uh, beside my work, I'm also uh, uh, involved uh, in open source community for over uh, 15 years. I started from uh, uh, acting as a uh, company chairman of Hong Kong News Musical, and also the uh, only chairman of open source Hong Kong and member of the uh, Geelong Research Committee, and was a representative in Hong Kong. And, uh, in these uh, five years, I organized and speak and participants in an uh, open source uh, conference in, in East Asia and US, such as Taiwan, uh, Korea, Japan, Malaysia, Singapore, and Bay Area. So, um, what we will talk about today is that uh, we, will, we will talk about the uh, uh, local weather information from the local uh, authorities to the open data, and then we will uh, take a look at the Geelong Shell extension because they have some uh, uh, two weather widgets at the uh, Geelong Shell extension. So, uh, this is the Hong Kong Authority website. So, it looks like this, okay? So, we can find out some uh, uh, weather information, some uh, graphics some diagram to display the uh, distribution of uh, wind, rainfall. And uh, some uh, weather hobbies uh, launched another website is Weather Underground Hong Kong, which provides some uh, Hong Kong and some regional uh, uh, cities uh, with inf weather information, such as uh, Taiwan, uh, also the, uh, the North uh, West Pacific. And this is uh, the uh, weather information from China. So you can find out uh, uh, different uh, city size uh, temperature, something like that. And also the, red, uh, the weather forecast. And this is the uh, website of uh, CWB, of, uh, it is a uh, Taiwan uh, Weather Authority. So we can find out uh, how is the outlook of the weather in different cities in Taiwan as well. This is the website of uh, Joy Typhoon Warning Center, which to provide some information of uh, typhoon in uh, different oceans which include uh, the uh, North West uh, Pacific Ocean. So we can know whether any typhoon hitting Hong Kong or Taiwan, something like that. So for the weather data, um, this is the uh, regional weather data provided from Hong Kong Authority website. So you can find a uh, different distance of Hong Kong and their temperature and the wind speed as well. And uh, this, report, this, this weather data is updated in each uh, 10 minutes. And actually, um, this looks like HTML, but actually the main content is uh, 10 test. So, this log are uh, kind of open data. So, what is open data? So uh, one of a uh, professor in in Canada, which mentioned uh, defined the free laws, free laws, free laws of uh, open government data. But they, but they mean if so one is that uh, when it cannot be spied the it uh, or index that it does not not exist, which means that with the uh, just like Google or Google cannot spy the the. Uh, the website or data 
it cannot, it does not exist on the internet actually. So, uh, another law is that uh, with it is not coverable in open and machine readable format. Uh, uh, other uh, search engine cannot use it because they can they cannot know what what is the meaning of the uh, of, of, of the limiting uh, volumes. So as you provide uh, you want to tell others that uh, the current temperature is uh, 20 degrees, but if you not using some open machine readable format, such as uh, XML tab to to code the uh, chanting, the limited values. Uh, other uh, certainly cannot, uh, or other computer program doesn't know that is we we present the current temperature. And also, with the uh, legal framework, does not allow you to uh, repurpose it. It is not uh, open data uh, as, uh, as well. Uh, that means um, with, uh, with, with you spread the uh, homo assertive website, but with homo, homo assertive website, uh, the homo assertive does not allow you to, to, uh, to uh, distribute the information to others. It's not open data as well. But, um, but fortunately, uh, homo assertive uh, allow uh, other people to, to distribute they are um, they are whether information for uh, for a long profit use yeah and also the uh, Tim Berners-Lee the inventor of the World Wide Web he also built a website five star data dot info which uh, which is a five star department scheme of open data suggested by Tim Berners-Lee. And so what is five star open data? So with your uh, with your stuff available on the on the web uh, under an open license, it is a one star open data. Whatever format it is. Maybe you you can scan a document to convert into a PDF uh, file or maybe it gives us an image inside a PDF file. Maybe it is not machine readable, but if you put the, this document on the internet and distribute under uh, open license, it is a uh, one star uh, open data. And uh, two, uh, two star open data is that uh, if you make it available in such a data set, uh, you use a Excel file to store your data set, weather data, temperature, wind speed, wind directions. It is the second, uh, it is a uh, two star open data. And three star open data is that uh, if you use a long profile format, which means an uh, open format, if you use a CSV instead of an uh, Excel file, uh, it is a three star open data. If you use um, URIs to develop some of your uh, data, so uh, other people can point to uh, your your start or your data is a four star uh, open data. What uh, what does it mean is that if you uh, if you uh, make the URL or such as uh, such as data uh, uh, information dot hk slash uh, uh, central slash temperature, and then this URL returns uh, uh, the current temperature. The limited volumes of current temp temperature it is a four star open data. And with your data linked to uh, other data provided by other external bodies, external organization, it is a five star open data. So, this is what the uh, five star uh, department scheme of open data is suggested by the uh, university. So, in Hong Kong, uh, Hong Kong government launched the um, uh, open data data set in in Hong Kong. Uh, I think uh, three three years ago. Uh, yeah, three years ago. And also, they have a first app a competition. Uh, uh, actually, the second competition in Hong Kong in uh, this uh, this year. 
and uh, they have uh, where the information provided by the data dot uh, one, the open data uh, data set in Hong Kong. Um, uh, so, uh, so from the Hong Kong city website, what does they provide? They provide hourly uh, Hong Kong weather report, uh, which you know whether they uh, uh, information in Hong Kong by uh, 10, 10 minutes updates and also weather forecast and also uh, we need uh, weather forecast as well and typhoon report and forecast and some other uh, minus uh, weather information report as well but uh, at the data dot one the open data provided from uh, by uh, Hong Kong government they only provide uh, seven uh, 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 Seven out access feed of the uh, of different uh, weather report or forecast information. So it is not useful. It is not useful by other uh, application team worker. That's not that, uh, that's not like this. So you only can use the uh, RAS uh, readers to subscribe to the data set to read the. Uh, to read this kind of report by your eyes. So it is not readable by the uh, com, uh, com, com, uh, software, by, so, by computer software. So I posted a blog on my own blog website to, uh, to talk about the focus of open government data in Hong Kong last year. And, uh, and I just say that uh, when Information at the data dot one only provides seven data set to return up at the speed. So one word to describe the weather information provided by Hong Kong government is uh, is use, useless. Okay. So is come and also actually uh, Hong Kong authority provide a uh, pay service to uh, to uh, to distribute uh, weather information the weather data to other company in SML format. So it is still a gap be between the, op the, the open data and the serve and the commercial service provided by Hong Kong Authority. So that and at the uh, data set uh, data one data set they only use a uh, p-tab to uh, to include to code or hold the whole report con content and more and also the data owners as well use the uh, RAS description tab use the dis di description tab to code the whole content. So whether at the data dot one is uh, is just a report log uh, data and. Technically, JSON or XML format are better available by the computer program. In, in uh, Hong Kong government, in a uh, document provided uh, in the public consultation document provided by Hong Kong government, Digital 21 Strategy, it mentions that it is uh, quite good that uh, they, they, they have a one paragraph to to talk about the uh, open data strategy, what they are suggesting. They are suggesting that um, they, su they suggest a uh, government should release the data in digital format in open data. And, and also, they also uh, suggest government department to be, uh, to release open data and also provide the uh, API, the application program uh, interface as well, so that uh, other people can use the data easy. And also, uh, they mentioned that uh, the current the current open data, and they 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 say that. Is a is a new new business opportunity to the uh, to the Hong Kong company as well, and we is benefit to the uh, society. 
And he also wants some example in United States as well that uh, open data uh, after uh, release of op uh, open data is solve some uh, uh, some uh, some uh, so 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 some so so many problems as well. So in uh, Taiwan, uh, they also have some open data for the weather. So uh, CWP released some uh, released open weather data, and most of the communities uh, GCOV.TLB is also working at the open data as well. So uh, this is the web file of the uh, open weather data at the CWP. So you can see that uh, they have uh, many different type, different category of the weather data, weather data, weather data, and in each category they have different types of uh, uh, weather information as well. And all of them are in a comparable form, form such as uh, XML. So you can see this this XML. So this kind of uh, uh, open data is easily available by other computer programs. And at the GCOV.TW, they promote the information transparency. And they also develop uh, information platform and tools for our society of the citizen participants as well. And they, uh, they promote uh, open data, information transparency, and they are also working in open source model as well. And they have a step over for like a QMA system for public to ask for data, to ask for data which they are looking for as well. And GCOV.TW is, is established after a Taiwan Yahoo open head day in uh, October uh, 2012. And who the uh, participant in uh, GCOV.TW uh, just like a hacker, a uh, professor at the university and a uh, uh, non-profit non organization, student writers and some digital media and legal professionals as well. Uh, they organize more than five uh, bi-monthly hackathons since uh, December uh, of the same, same year. So this is one of one of uh, data visualized problem produced by uh, developed by uh, GCOV.TW is uh, air pollution index. So you can you can easily to understand that uh, uh, air the air quality in Taiwan in different city. So. You can check it out at the uh, uh, GitHub. They have uh, they have the this the the uh, air pollution index website of the GCW uh, TW. Uh, it is intended to develop a web-based visualized map for the air pollutions and use open data provided by the uh, EPA at uh, in Taiwan. Environment Protection Administrations, um, and you can find out the uh, uh, air pollution index and the uh, detailed data from different uh, 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 air pollution monitoring states in Taiwan. Um, another interesting project uh, developed by GCV of TW is uh, Motec. Uh, actually, it's uh, it's a Chinese, uh, it's a online Chinese dictionary, and also the uh, Chinese dictionary available on your smart on your smartphone as well. So you can use it online or offline. So you can find uh, many many different uh, Chinese terms. Yeah. So when I some when sometimes I I forgot how to write a Chinese words, uh, I also use this dictionary to find which Chinese uh, words should I should I write. 
So the one the one data of the model is come from the uh, the ministry of the uh, uh, of education in Taiwan is one is the education department in Taiwan, and um, uh, and the um, um, people in Taiwan always complain the of the original discipline provided by the uh, education by the education department in Taiwan is very ugly. So they build another one by they, by themselves with the more data provided by the department. So the community view of the uh, web based uh, traditionally with uh, um, 160,000 Chinese items and also other uh, local items as well. And it supports uh, auto commission, searching, and, off, uh, and offline versions as well. And also, because TCLV document is always an open source, so they they are source code and data are available on on the on their headpad as well. So uh, why web scraping? When open data is not available, and this uh, one of uh, one of uh, pay uh, the TV program schedule of uh, one of our uh, pay TV provider in Hong Kong. So I, I like to watch foot, foot, uh, football games, so I usually I will check out uh, which game will be paid up, uh, will be live on which channel. But when I when, uh, just before the game start, I go to the website, this website usually, uh, it will be done. Because many people to collect to the website, and why it is slow? So you will understand why. <laughs> because they you Microsoft, they use IIS, they use ASP, they use Spec. So it could not be collected at any peak hour. So I wrote my first uh, web script uh, in PHP in 2004, and also I write other uh, web script as well as uh, to to uh to spread some uh bus wow information from uh, from one of uh, uh Hong Kong uh, bus company and also uh uh Hong Hong government cooperate with one of the uh, university in Hong Kong to provide to develop a uh, public transportation and privacy system which uh just like uh Google Map so you can check out on the map and then. Uh, uh, input your uh, uh, your current lo location and destination. They uh, that, that may be provide some sub sub uh, suggested uh, policy transportation wall to you. But the UI is uh, very poor and also very ugly. So I also want uh, another uh, best paper to uh, to collect all public transportation information from that website as well. So and um, 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 in Hong Kong, people are always uh, want to know uh, any typhoon is coming to Hong Kong because because when the typhoon hitting to Hong Kong directly, usually uh, Hong Kong people will get one additional uh, holiday. So they they will they will they they will they will very focused to 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 uh, to long any time is coming to Hong Kong. So, um, but as I previously mentioned that there is, there is no uh, open data available in Hong Kong Authority, and also no RS and port, low port, port as well, and we cannot check, as I say, I cannot check uh, Hong Kong Authority website or Jai uh, Tong, Joy Thai Phone Morning Center every day, uh, Wednesday every day, because I need to work, I cannot check it every day. So, I might, uh, I developed two uh, projects as well, related to weather. So, weather change, which is, uh, which is, uh, which we have a data account, which actually we, uh, uh, the this policy is uh, to provide some uh, hourly current weather report and also focus 
because a uh, typhoon signal warning uh, issued by a uh, home authority to uh, to to post it to the Twitter. Yeah. So my my Twitter friends and also I can look at the Twitter and then to see this kind of uh, weather information. And the backend side uh, actually it used a Python, Skype, with database, and Twitter, and MMTP. MMTP is a protocol of live scope because because the uh, because uh, five uh, before five years ago I uh, I am still using new new scope with my friend. Yeah. And the funnel used a uh, Twitter and new scope to distribute to to distribute uh, better information. So uh, it was interviewed. So I am also my project was interviewed by uh, uh, one of the major cities in the NTR in Hong Kong, this metro part in uh, 2009. So it gives me. And also another project is that uh, is the uh, TC chat. So this is related to Typhoon. So um, so uh, actually. Uh, JTWC Joint Typhoon One Center and most of Hong Kong Authority uh, did not provide uh, a better UI to uh, to to tell you the path of the typhoon before this project launch. Okay, I will tell you why I I, I mentioned this before this project launch. Uh, actually, this project is called the Typhoon Curve and the Focus. And the forecast path that the typhoon can over the Google Map. So you can see the current path and then this forecast path. And this is the first uh, typhoon uh, checking map in Hong Kong using Google Map. And after I, I launched, uh, after three months, I launched this project. Uh, Whether the one Hong Kong also used. Send skill, uh, send, uh, send, send skill to to develop uh, uh, their their platform checking map on their website with Google Map as well. And after a year, Hong Kong Authority also understand that it's uh, good to use Google Map to uh, port the platform uh, checking map. So they finally the Hong Kong Authority is also using Google Map as well. And also this this project is uh is also uh uh this will the uh typhoon information to the Twitter as well. So for the West Gaping, uh yes uh computer software can can lead to uh ex to extract the quick information from the website. It can it can be for business, for hobbies and for research people as well. So how should we do the uh, rest campaign? First, we should look for white URL to, to be squared. And then, after we find out the URL, we should uh, look for the white content from the website. So which part of the, we, we should look for which part of the website we should uh, square. And then save the data into the data, data store. And finally, we should Consider when should we want the West uh, West Capital program once again? Because you cannot one 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 is uh, every minute. Otherwise, the the website, the web server, or the administrator of the of, of this web server will complain you you are you are overload their set they are server. So for uh, weather information, normally I will uh, I will want the uh, West Cap program in each 10 minutes. Yeah. So uh, use of open source in West Cap. So here's uh, some uh, tools available which help to write uh, West Cap. Why West, uh, West, West, West Cap? Yeah. So we just need to wait for the data provider to release data in machine readable format. So I use a Python program and with the regular express library and also use a scheduled web 
Kelly Kimmer as well. So why Python and Scatly? Python is my favorite programming language in the last five years, and Scatly is a uh, quite powerful uh, West, uh, West scripting framework in Python. So what is Scatly? Scatly is a West scripting framework, and it also it can uh, spread the website and extract the subtitle data on the website as well. So, and um, and what uh, is research is that you can define the data structure of the data which you want to spread, and you can write a spider to to extract the data data as well, and it include a built-in uh, built feature is that you can use the HTML and XML selector to select the, the data and extract the data out. And it also built in for JSON, CSV, and XML output. So actually, you, you, you can write the Spider program to, 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 uh, to extract data, and then you, you just need to write the 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 uh, the data store part, and then it can output directly to J, JSON. And it also in, include a uh, interactive sales console and web service and tenant console as well. So I started a new open source project HKC over the last year to create open web data by myself. So this project is open source and it is a uh, web scraping uh, on city website and open data is standard machine readable data format in JSON and XML. It are available on the GitHub as well. So the first question is that uh, it provides our new weather report, which includes temperature and humidity from uh, over uh, 20 uh, weather, weather stations and export in JSON format. And the second way, version is that it, uh, it includes a regional weather report as well, which includes a wind direction, wind speed, and, and the next uh, guess. And the final version, uh, sorry, the current version is that I also implement the data, data, data store side, which uh, it, it is the UI of Django, Django web, web, web framework. So it, uh, it used a Django web framework to store data and also uh, added uh, rainfall data as well. So the the future development is that uh, I will uh, develop some JSON APIs as well and input uh, typing data and also weather warning report from home or safety. So, how we install this code is very simple. So, you, you, you first you use a virtual environment to build a virtual environment for a for Python project and then you use you activate the Python environment and then you give to clone the the my my GitHub with research of almost weather and then change directly to the uh, to the project directly and then use a PIP to install uh, all required uh, Python library from my Python file and then you only you only need to one step command to to run the web scatter. And then this command can uh, can, can output the data in JSON format to a file. So it's quite easy. So uh, so it uses regular expressions and uh, use a HTML selector and use its JSON CSV and SL output as well. So this is the JSON Format output of the metadata. Mm -hmm. So, in genome cell extensions, what is genome cell? Genome cell is a core user interface function of uh, for genome. So, it includes a switch to the Windows launch applications and panel at the top of the screen and activity overview and the message chat uh, at the uh, at the bottom of the screen. So this is the UI. So you can see the uh, activity. 
but just by a start button. And then you can see the top menu, includes a call, and then add some, uh, add some system status and user menus. And the, the bottom part, you can see the message tree as well. And this is the test. You can start some uh, uh, common program which you already use, and this is the web, uh, web, uh, web space. So, geo cell extension is uh, is is a uh, is some small pieces of code developed by a third party developers. That means they could be both of you. And geo cell extension modify the way how the G Genome environment works and which similar to a uh, Chrome or Firefox uh, add ons and extension can be found and installed on uh, extension.genome.org uh, directly. So, what can Genome cell extension do? So, each extension can make a very small change uh, moving your talk to the right hand side of the screen or make a big change uh, out. Publishing uh, uh, windows in the uh, field of the view in different way as well. So in the genome cell extension, you can find two uh, two wicket related to weather. One is weather and another one is open data. So actually two uh two wicket will add a uh, will add a uh, small uh, wicket on the top bar. Uh, beside the core to show the temperature and then when you click on the uh, on the widget you will show some detailed information uh, some detailed weather information such as uh, current temperature and the uh, wind direction wind speed and the uh, weather forecast as well so when you go to essential.gmail.org website and you can file the widget and then you just click it on and then it will pull that download and install uh, weather for the extensions so you, you click install the that uh, and then you will you will get the, this extension installed so um, so installation is very simple and you only need a delon set integration plug in for your browser is installed and, and, and editable on, uh, in your browser patterns. And go to extension.gmail.org to find any uh, genome extension you are interested and install it. And you should uh, whitelist your, uh, the, this website and turn off the click to pay features at your browser and make sure and see it's installed because those uh, cell extension is uh, system file. So this uh, weather, this is the UI of weather uh, widget. So you can find the uh, the temperature on the top bar, and then when you click it, you some uh, data in it as well. And we have uh, extension patterns. You can change some options, so there's a uh, temperature unit and the wind speed unit, something like that. So you can find it at the GitHub as well. So time is ticking, so I speak very fast. And another one is that uh, open weather. Actually, uh, the UI is very similar to the weather one, but all of the data is coming from uh, openweathermap.org, which is uh, which uh, 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 which uh, free weather data and forecast API provided by uh, by a lot of public organizations. So you, so you can use that API to um, to get a uh, bit get uh, weather data from different uh, cities. Yeah. And uh, back to uh, this one weather we we get is that. They uh, they use the uh, weather inform uh, data uh, uh, sorry weather information data provided by uh, Yahoo Weather. 
So the problem is that um, the problem is that um, Yahoo Metadata data is uh, uh, Yahoo Metadata data is still different from uh, the local authentic metadata data. So normally we will we will in, in Hong Kong in Taiwan or I think also in in China we will look at the uh, where the information from the local authority rather than Yahoo or 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 web.com something like, like that. So I think the less weather we get should be the world that the funds uh open weather data collected from this one uh, uh local uh positive web website in China or in Taiwan and Hong Kong. So, uh, develop a weather widget is very simple, but the the problem is that uh, we also need to develop uh, some web scraper to collect uh, weather information from different uh, local or authority website. So this is uh, what I want to share. So thank you.
I think it uh, it can be conflicted uh, at the uh, at the platform, but uh, dialogue at the at, at the genome cell extensions. Yeah. Yeah. So 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 this goes from CWD uh, to your to your uh, web paper and then. Uh, uh, the, the I, extension I did not my West paper for the okay. CWP yet, and also uh, we don't need a uh, West paper for the CWP. Uh, we doesn't need a, a com complex uh, West paper for the CWP website because uh, CWP already released uh, many of web, uh, many weather information in open data format. So we only need to wire a simple web scraper to download exact data from the from the CW website and then it is all what is already in the uh, com computable for format. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. So one less than one minute left, so any questions? Okay, yeah. Uh, uh, the data uh, can be used from uh, 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 Sorry. Uh, I think there is a standard application in GNOME to show GNOME uh, weather information uh, called GNOME weather. GNOME GNOME weather. Weather. Yeah. yeah. Can the data ah uh, can the data be used in the application? In which application? Uh, GNOME weather. Uh, your I don't understand your question. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. It means uh, your application, the information can share with the genome, yeah. right? Yeah. The data, the data can share with the genome. Oh, my project. Yeah. 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 Uh, my project is up. Is up Is ho uh, can provide a uh, metadata in an uh, open data format, and only that uh, I did not start to why uh, to modify existing uh, genome weather uh, cell extensions to 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 display the uh, the weather data of Hong Kong in the weekend, yeah. Only just the weekend is not weather, yeah, yeah. So you come from Japan. So. And uh, how how about the open data weather data in Japan for the weather? Hello. <laughs> Any machine will go for that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I think uh, they yeah, normally use the Yahoo data. Oh. So uh, Japanese will use uh, yeah. Yahoo data, Yahoo weather. Maybe. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Okay. Alright. Hands up. <laughs> Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you.